<laughs> Hello, it's Tuesday the 5th of September and uh, what a funny old day it's been. It's been a good day but, uh, but a funny one because it was divided into two and uh, this morning it absolutely poured with rain and it was quite cold and I put on I put on decidedly autumn clothes and this afternoon it's got hot well you know not really hot but it's warmed up it's uh, it's got up to about 22 degrees uh, C and uh, which was an awful lot warmer than it was this morning so uh, today I have uh, been off to the hospital uh, to see a cardiologist uh, as planned and he told me exactly what I thought he would, which is that my heart is absolutely fine. And uh, there is a valve that has got the, the most minor little thingy, uh, but it's not, absolutely nothing to worry about. And I'm uh, fighting fit and off I go and uh, not to worry about my heart until, well, you know, until I need to. <laughs> so that's all good. And this afternoon I have a uh, come home and then harvested i've done a pound of plums or just over a pound of plums half a pound of raspberries yay uh three and a quarter pounds of tomatoes and i'm not adding this up as i go so i'll have to put the total up on the screen as usual uh, and another four and a half pounds of apples and then after that i thought well i could do some more harvesting and i am yeah, prepping and getting it into the freezer or I could do something else which we really, really need doing. So, and so is exactly what I'm going to do. We need some new tea towels because our old ones, well, are just, they're worn out. And also I'm using quite a lot of them wrapped around uh, the, the demijohns of wine that are brewing. So we are very, very short of tea towels. And I said, well, let's not buy any. Let's go out to the barn where I have a, quite a large collection of vintage fabric uh, because amongst other things I hoard vintage fabric in a way that's probably a bit unhealthy but I do love it so what I have is quite a lot of just you know just girly pretty patterns and uh, oh yeah one day I'll do something with it uh, I occasionally I do patchwork things with it I have made a couple of patchwork quilts for my grandchildren um, but so it did mean we don't have to buy buy new tea towels so I've just been out to get some fabric and uh, I'm going to show it to you because it's lovely I've got this and I've got this which is from uh, the I can get a date for you because there's a date on the selvage it's from uh, 1988 look at this 1988 uh, old Laura Ashley linen union fabric uh, which means it's a linen cotton combination and, uh, and should be very absorbent and uh, and some da, da, da. this is from the 19s this is from the 1970s uh, vintage fabric indeed and uh, it makes me very happy it really does and um, it's it's old enough uh, that it hasn't got a date on it um, so my I'm guessing that this is pre-1976 pre-1976 so it could be 75 76 something like that and uh, oh, just just love it and I've got and then I've also got some with uh, well it's like a it's a pastoral toile de jouy uh, scene and we're gonna have loads of tea towels and then uh, this one is uh, it's got I don't know why I've got this fabric because it's not very me but anyway I've got it so uh, this one has got uh, it's got scenes of well you know hunting dogs and harvest type things um, and it's oh 
it's a design called the setter so we now know these are uh, either red setters or well they look like Gordon setters to me but um, but anyway and so that's a nice old fabric and that's from 1989 uh, really nice actually do you know what if I if I use some of this and cut out uh, a panel a vignette uh, a vignette there that would, I could make some very nice cushions however I'm not really a dog person I'm a cat person I don't really want dog cushions uh, but someone else might uh, but in the meantime I'm going to use some of that fabric uh, to make tea towels with now don't you know it's all variation and it's all <laughs> it's all variation and it's you know no two days are the same here it's all and it's all good fun so that's my next job is uh, I've got the sewing machine here uh, it's a lovely old old and trusted sewing machine and uh, it's very much trusted and it's and it is quite old but it is electric if I can find what I've done with the electric lead and if not I'm gonna have to hand sew them which I don't really fancy doing well no I just won't I'll use pinking shears and uh, and just cut the shapes out and then sew them at a later date but uh, so I'm about to go off and uh, and look for the electric lead and uh, and hopefully by oh, where are we now it's 10 to 7 so hopefully by 8 o'clock we'll have some tea towels and so wherever you are in the world and whatever you've been up to today I hope it's been a good one for you and I also hope you can join me again tomorrow <laughs>